Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In last video, we have seen how we can create hello world kind of application using class and functional component. So in this video, we are going to understand the use of view component, then the text component and the styles which we are using here style sheet so for that i just remove all these component because doesn't require these component right now here so i remove this now i say here uh, first of all uh, view like this and in this view i say one text component and i say here you can say a list of computer languages like this i say list of computer languages like this now here you see that this is the view here i'm using and we have a style sheet for container also i will explain this use of this also so here i want to display uh, information of my uh, lab computer languages so i can give this information inside this also here or i can give here also um, out outside of this view component it depend on me where i want to explain it so i can use here also or i can use here also so i say here uh, that uh, for that i can create array also or i can use the use of map so i say here const I say lang equal to and here I say array I say Java then I say here Kotlin then I say here Python then I say here uh, JavaScript then I say here C lang C language or I can say go lang not a C we can say go lang like this I save this so uh, you see that uh, here now what i do here uh, i say here that uh, this jsx and uh, here i say lang dot map and under this map under this map i have uh, the arrow function like this and i just do this and here i say uh, the lang value means and i say index you see and here i will display the information that is required so that information is the text which i want to display as a list i say here text and in this text uh, what i do first of all i say key and here in this key i just display index and then under this uh, I say here that uh, indexed plus one like this then I say dot then space and then I say lang the information that I want to display so I save this you see that this way I will display the information and I try to see this you see this information is coming here the information we have displayed like this in all the information but you see it coming in a center why it is coming in a center because we have this style so how we can make some changes so you see that is flex and background is white and we have item in the center and we have this also so i say here uh, in place of center i say that is a flex start save this try to see the position you see we are on the top here now I change this to uh, uh, flex start you see we have in the starting of this but it is coming just top of this so we have to give some margin also so I say I need a margin uh, uh, for that uh, I can create one more uh, you see style not only this because the problem is here in a heading so i say uh, this one i say style here 
I say this should be uh, style dot uh, I can say uh, the list you see list information so this list is not available I have to create here under this so I say here list and here I will set the property so I say margin uh, margin from the top you see I need margin from the top is 20 then I say margin from the left so I say margin from the left is also 20 I save this so you see some changes are there so you see something is better so I say uh, from this we need 30 space and from it we need 10 space save this and you see that it looking better now we can give the font size also for that uh, I say here uh, this text information means heading so I say style equal to and I say uh, style dot heading because this is the heading type so again I design the one more object here so I say heading and here I say a font weight here so I say font weight is bold and you see it is pure CSS and I say font size font size is 30 and I save this so the I am setting this for this heading means list of computer programming so if you see this it's looking so big so I decrease the size and I say uh, the size of uh, this is uh, 20 say this you see list of programming and I can give uh, uh, more space from the top so I say 40 you see we have this now we uh, should give some margin or some space here in in this list also so for that uh, uh, you see we have this list so here I can give a style and here I can pass the style also I say style uh, dot uh, you can say uh, uh, we can say list item list item list items so for this I say here uh, that list items and here I provide this so I just increase little bit of size also so I say font size uh, that I say uh, font size to 15 and uh, I say uh, padding padding also I can give padding to 5 save this now we see uh, some changes in a list you see we have a space also and we uh, give the font size to 15 so I can give to 20 size save this you see we have a bigger size also like this and uh, uh, you see that we have understand the use of this style sheets style sheets how we can create this and we have understand the use of view also view we use like a div tag we have and uh, we have a box uh, component in material ui and in the html we have a div tag so we can use view tag here and text we use like a p paragraph text or like a h for heading tag to display text under um, um, react native so you see we use uh, here this map function also filter function and with the help of this we display the list here and uh, we use the view we use the text we use the styles we create styles also for this and with the help of this we design this all this we are making uh, using expo go and same kind of thing we will also design use design in react native project react native cli project also same kind of interface we will also design by using react native cli we are using here react react expo so you see i try to uh, give you a proper and a complete uh, you can say uh, information about view text and style sheet and i hope you understand it uh, clearly
and if you understand it if you like this video please do subscribe thank you for watching this video